Well, I'm certainly uh, not an expert on Three Mile Island, but I know, you know, I know uh, the history and know something about it. In my, in my opinion, Three Mile Island, the real causes were a mechanical failure and then operator error. And I think a lot of things were learned about man-machine interface, how, uh, how uh, the machine uh, signals what it has done or what has occurred to the operator, how the operator then interprets that and acts, how the plant can be forgiving when the operator misinterprets and takes the wrong kind of action. I think it was a lot of that kind of work, uh, valuable work, that came out of the TMI experience as well as uh, work on emergency planning. I think in, um, in Fukushima, uh, I, again, I think it's too early to tell what we'll learn about uh, plant design and in-depth detail kind of things. I mean, the obvious things that everybody looks at right now, again, uh, the location of the plant relative to this large subduction zone, the worst kinds of earthquakes. Mother Nature surprised us in terms of the earthquake and tsunami intensity. The, uh, the density of the plants, six plants in one location, the electrical distribution, the backup power supplies, you know, I think obviously uh, that'll, uh, that'll get looked at and uh, there'll undoubtedly be some lessons learned from that.